What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. It's your boy Eddie Wright checking in. Today, we are wanting to encourage everyone to live a lemon pepper lifestyle. You heard that right. A lemon pepper lifestyle. One of the most famous ingredients in Southern cuisine is one, garlic, and two, lemon pepper. So, one thing we're going to do today is we are going to take a nice St. Louis slab of ribs and we are going to do some smoked lemon pepper ribs complete with a lemon pepper glaze. Let's get to it. Got our slab right here laid down ready to go and we're just going to use a simple seasoning palette because we really want the lemon pepper to sign through so we're going to use our lower layer of jonesy q ecstasy we'll do the same on the back and front sides of the rib and our top layer is simply going to be lemon pepper from kinders available at your local costco we'll go light with that and we'll add <clears throat> And we'll add a dash of money, honey, just for color. And we repeat that process on the other side. Now the smoker's already up and running this morning. We've got some slabs already in. So we wanted to do this last slab as a test slab. And uh, we're going to see how it goes across today with a few customers and even ourselves. We're hoping to pull off something amazing and something unique, most definitely and um, just have something that we may be able to add on the specialty menu. Once again, encouraging everyone to live a lemon pepper lifestyle. That being said, got the slab seasoned. Let's get it out to the pit and get it off. Pit's up and running about 245, 250. Got smoke billowing up. Running on our old hickory today, AKA Unicron. And we're gonna get this thing in here and just let it cruise low and slow. Not a lot of pressure today to get things done, so we're gonna take our time. We're gonna keep the tub right where it is. We're gonna put the rack right here. We're gonna close it up, and we'll be back in a little while. A few moments later. Out here on the trailer and where we are within the process, it's time for us to wrap. So, we have quite a few slabs to wrap today, but we're specifically going to work on our lemon pepper slab first and show you guys what we're doing. So, what we're first gonna do so we're going to lay down a little small bed of extra seasoning here, strictly lemon pepper. We also put together a little what I like to call lemon pepper glaze. It's just the, the code name for it right now. We're just going to lay a little bit of that down as well. We're going to take our one lemon pepper slab, and we know this is the one because of the order we put them down in. We're going to lay it top side down. We're going to repeat the process. Layer of lemon pepper seasoning. A little bit of our house layout house glaze. We're gonna wrap and get it back out on the smoker and let it finish tenderizing, and we'll be back for the results. Moments later. All right, everything's done and finished. We're about to break the lemon pepper out of the wrap. This is the first time ever us doing something like this, and we're just kind of waiting to see what our results are gonna be. Uh, we ran them a little far. Uh, we can see a lot of pullback, but we like the smell already. The aroma that it's giving off is most definitely what we were looking for. We're gonna flip them over here. Let you see the top. Looks like a regular rib across the top, but the magic is most definitely in the flavor. So with that being said, we're gonna go ahead and slice into it. And we're gonna give it a taste. This is the lemon, the smoked lemon pepper rib from Eddie Wright Barbecue. Possibly a menu item, we'll see. Uh, they're still really hot. Uh, we ran them too far, but as you can see, with the old hickory pit, the smoke penetration is most definitely through and through. Looks very good. We'll go ahead and try the same piece here and let's see what we got. I was originally afraid to go really heavy with the lemon pepper. I am very happy about what we decided to do with trying to balance the lemon pepper with the rest of the season. It has a very good balance. It has the lemon pepper note to it. You get a little bit of the extra seasoning on top. I think this is a win. It has a great lemon pepper aftertaste and presence, probably from our little um, 
glaze slash sauce that we put together. It most definitely did exactly what we wanted to do, guys. We're gonna call this one a success. Maybe a few things we may change on the uh, next version, but right now, as a test, smoked lemon pepper ribs is a success. My name is Eddie Wright. Thank you guys for tuning in, and always remember, you too can do amazing barbecue the right way. We'll see you next time.